Hey guys, Kurt here from Convertica and today we're going to talk about landing pages. And so today we're going to go through and talk about what makes a high converting landing page. We're also going to go through and look at a bunch of different examples. So you can have some takeaways to go and apply them to your own landing pages. By the end of this video, you're going to have some general framework you can use to set up your own landing pages that you can scale with your own company and your own offer. And you can also have a way to think about landing pages. Now, it's not so much about having a very complicated landing page. It's, it's actually quite the opposite. It's about having a very clear offer. It's giving the user a very clear call to action or a next step to take and then making it easy for them to either purchase your product or submit a lead. That's pretty much it. Of course, that's easier said than done. You also have to build credibility, make sure that you come across legitimate, make sure that you have a very credible layout and website. But at the end of the day, it all comes down to just having a very clear and concise offer and a very clear call to action to allow the user to take the next step. Now, the problem is, if you don't have a good landing page framework or a good landing page design with conversions in mind, you could be spending months or even years to get your website ranking to the top of Google, get these valuable visitors to your website, and then don't even convert. So the whole point of getting your, your landing pages in front of these users is to get them to submit leads or purchase your product. And the same thing goes for Facebook ads or Google AdWords. If you're paying for people to click over to your website, you want your website to convert in the best way possible, of course. So we're gonna go through and show you some examples of some not so nice landing pages so that you can have a clear idea on what not to do. And then we'll go through and look at a bunch of really good converting landing pages, they have a very clear offer, very clear call to action. So hopefully you can have some takeaways uh, to apply on your own website. To begin with, we're gonna go through and look at some bad badly designed landing pages or bad, badly designed home pages it's to show you not what to do so we're at uh, paradisewater.com I think the main takeaway straight away is that you don't really know what's going on your eyes are pulled in many directions so the first thing that catches my eye I think is the phone number up top but it's also not very clear what exactly they're offering when you first look at the landing page. And that's the most important point. Second point, what do you do next? I guess you could call them, but ideally they would have a, a online uh, purchasing system or online ordering system where you can just order and have it delivered to your home and pay for it and everything just on online. And maybe they do, but uh, it's not, it's not entirely clear if they do or not straight out of the gate. There's also a bunch of very sort of redundant uh, headers and so on that uh, that don't make it exactly clear what they're offering, as well as just your eyes being pulled in many, many directions. So you've got call to action here, here. So this, of course, is a badly designed landing page. And of course, the next one I'm gonna show you is an absolute horrific one, and it might remind you of the early 2000s and how the internet used to look. But here's an example of definitely not what to do. So <laughs> I found this one and just thought I'd share it real quickly because it is absolutely horrific. So we've got a serene naturist based in Manchester, not far from center index page completely redundant to have that there <clears throat> and i'm still not quite sure what a naturist is okay so it's a very professional therapy center we cater for naturist client ladies gentlemen and couples still not quite clear oh so it's a massage parlor okay so just by reading this mountain of text that's not styled at all or paragraphed or um, laid out correctly at all, I can finally find out what it is. And it, oh, it's just horrific. Oh, it's a uh, half naked lady there or fully naked lady there. And uh, yeah, just really bad, no call to action. I guess if we wanted to contact them, I'm still trying to look 
yeah there's no way to even contact okay so I could click contact still so that's just down here the only way we can contact them right below the buttocks and yeah just absolutely horrific again most websites don't look like this these days but I still found it while I was researching so no clear offer no call to action and just absolutely horrific and not at all uh, viewable on mobile so what we'll do is now we'll go and look at some really good landing pages ones that are really modern and convert really well I'm sure so we've just jumped over to crazyegg.com as you can see the big difference is there's actually nowhere else to scroll on the home page there's a very clear offer make your website better instantly which I'm sure they split tested to hell uh, over 300,000 websites use crazy egg to improve what's working fix what isn't and test new ideas very simple very clear and then one call to action and you got some some little uh, sort of credibility indicators here start your third day free trial cancel anytime and then just one call to action where we would put in convertica.org show me my heat map and then they'll get us to sign up so very very simple sign up with Google or sign up with your email and then you can go through and access it and obviously they this is a high drop-off point so they have put testimonials here to further reinforce the the reason to sign up so very simple very easy and I just want to reinforce again very clear offer one call to action these guys would get an absolute ton of traffic too so let's jump over to another website I'm showing all websites in the same sort of niche here but it's because these guys have tested the hell out of their websites so hotjar.com heat map testing software a lot of guys you will use it and and know it really well so very clear offer understand how users behave on your website what they need and how they feel fast great slow manual days of collecting data and feedback rover hotjar is an intuitive visual way to discover consolidate and communicate user ideas very very clear you got some credibility here 35,000 companies sign up last month that's huge no credit card required and GDPR CCPA ready pretty cool stuff I'm sure they, there could be some optimizations here because I don't really see that I would put that maybe down here again they probably split tested this but I would want to test some other elements on this site and it's a little bit confusing and sign up with Google and sign up with email here and I would give a clearer call to action that then gets people to sign up with Google email but they're probably split tested it so who am I to say but the main thing is very clear offer very clear call to action and then if people want to read more they show exactly how their site works um, in a very clear fashion with a nice call to action and then this call to action try it for free here which both stand out very very clearly so I'm sure you're getting the, the theme here very clear offer very clear call to action and then the hustle.com is another one I don't think you can get more simple than this get daily news straight to your inbox the best tech business and tech in five minutes or less you've got one call to action and a few testimonials to further reinforce pretty simple so we have the same thing on convertica.org we have we'll increase your conversions by 20 to 100 percent on your website we've split tested a bunch of different variations of this and this is the one that performed by far the best um, and then get a free audit today so then people go through select their monetization method we send them a free audit further uh, supported by some credibility icons showing that we're rated 4.8 out of 5 on Trustpilot and then if people want to read more um, there's more and more credibility building a bit more about what we do very clear offer very simple call to action so I've tried to keep this video very simple to further reiterate the point when you're creating a landing page and you're creating a way for your visitors to get into contact with you just create it so it's very simple just design it with simplicity in mind you want your offer to be very clear don't try and confuse the user too much 
I like to think about it as if you're trying to explain something to a five-year-old. You want your offer to be so clear, there's no way that people can interpret it any way different. So you want a clear one to two line offer with two to three lines max in your subheading with a clear call to action that takes them to the next step. That's what you want above the fold, as simple as that. Now you can, as you saw on Hotjar, as you saw on our website, if you want to take it further, to further educate the users and this is worth testing like we saw on crazyegg.com you can just have a simple lander that is just the call to action the offer or they have a link below the call to action that has more information about their product but they obviously split tested it and it showed that more people signed up if they didn't have more information so that's one important thing to to take note of but if you're having problems with optimizing your landing pages or you need a hand from some experts, Convertica.org have worked with over 700 websites and run over 7,000 split tests in the last four years. So if you jump over to Convertica.org, you can get a full audit for free where our team will go through, look at all your landing pages, look at your website and show you where we think there's some opportunity to increase conversion. So to take advantage of that, jump over to Convertica.org today and send off your website with some details and we'll get back to you soon but until next time guys i hope you really like that video comment below remember to subscribe and i'll chat to you soon